So you might be in a weird situation where your plugged in headphones are just not working inside of your Android device. You can see that they're plugged in, but they just don't seem to be functioning or working at all. Now, the very first thing I'd recommend doing is first of all, making sure that you are using the exact same headphones that are suitable for your phone. USB-C headphones without a headphone jack can only be used with USB-C. These ones will not work. So if you found a way to somehow plug this in, it's not going to work. So keep that in mind. Now, another thing I recommend doing for the most part is making sure that the sound on your specific phone is up as high as you can, not as high as you can make it, but at least to a comfortable volume to where you should be able to hear it from your device. Sometimes people may have their things plugged into their device, but it just doesn't seem to be working or it appears that it's not working. So what you're going to want to do here is basically just make your way over to your sound panel. So you can usually just scroll down and find something that says like, like this vibration motor or something. You may want to go ahead and just tap on it to turn it off. If you can have the sound on, just kind of change a few things around and see if that ends up fixing it. You can also make your way over to your media output panel. So it should bring up a panel like this. And if it shows your specific you know, device and it shows like headphones that you're plugged in, we'll go ahead and kind of configure it around and make sure it's not actually playing out the music to another you know, Bluetooth headphones or some other device around you or another speaker around you. Now, another thing you can try doing is simply unplugging the headphones from your device and plugging it back in. So just unplug the headphones that you normally would have on your you know, device, wait a few seconds, plug it back in, and then we want to see if that ends up fixing the problem too. Now on top of that, if that still doesn't end up working, you may want to go ahead and try holding down the buttons that you normally would to restart your device. So hold down the buttons that you normally would to actually restart your phone. And now what you're going to want to do there is you want to go ahead and give it a few moments, hold down those buttons, restart your device, and that may end up fixing the problem too. If that's still not working, you may want to see if you can actually update your device. So go inside of your settings, your system settings, click on software update, click on download and install, and you want to try downloading and installing that update and that might end up fixing the problem for you as well. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.